I want to try and give a video answer because I think I can better explain it this way. So we're going to try this. I wanted to get your opinion on bar 3 from 1117. I'm sorry, 111 Was it a reasonable stop order sell? Or bars 1 and 2 strong enough? So to go short, traders would have. Excuse me. Would have to wait for the strong breakout down or second inch or short. My thoughts always in short trading range for the last three hours, and we are at the top of the range. Bear bar three a little big, but not ideal. But in the top half of the range, failed full breakout bar two. That was reversed by bar three, low four. Possible ABC move, 810 to 850. Well, eight ten. The overall, the biggest problem with sorting right here at bar three is well right here first thing I look at this before going back you have lower highs a spike yeah and then the spike could be maybe something of here point is is that we have a spike down lower highs We're, we're continuing to go down lower, and here we can clearly see it's a limited order market. You know, even though here at 840, you could say, as you said, low four. What was it? It was, uh, I think you could say one, two, three, four. It doesn't matter because all these are double tops. You can say here, here, double top until price strongly breaks above, preferably here. It's still a large trading range. It's still a large trading range when it goes up here, even. So, in terms of here, you are low, and I'd rather look to buy when you have. Strong bear bar, but two bull bars, strong breakout bar. We're collecting a lot of bull bars compared to bear bars. Two bear bars, I'm sorry, two bull bars, bear bar, three bull bars, bear bar, two bull, one bear, three bull, strong bear, strong bull bar. The, the, the bull bars just look stronger. And I, again, I don't know, I haven't looked at the higher time frames, but think about the, the math selling below this bar, assuming you're talking about this bar. If you sell one on a stop, one tick below, give you a, a better visual. Here is your risk about, so for you to take this trade, you need to make preferably two times your initial risk, which would be entry would be one tick below, stop at least one tick above. That means you have to get below the low of here just to make one times. In a trading range, the probabilities are, in, are not that good. It's not that good, especially after three bars up. So it almost makes more sense to do the opposite. See, the institutions can tell big risk, not great, not great reward in terms of probability. The best you'll probably get is 
maybe somewhere down here. So arguably it's a low one after a new breakout. Which means if this is a tight channel, if you think about it, broke up, we broke out, went up, pulled back, went up, pulled back, went up, pulled back, and you're selling at the, it would be selling at the bottom of a channel. So, so the math's not good. It'd make more sense to, to buy below. You know, however, once you get up here, it's different because the bulls want to get above here to end the chances of a double top. If they get one tick above, we're now more of a likely in a trading range than a bear trend, which they got. Let's see, the price was 27.25 and went to 27.50. Since it went one tick above, it's likely any pullback will stay below here. So we'll get some sort of higher low, which we got. You can see, obviously, a terrible place to buy. But when we pulled back, we formed arguably a low, a low one right here. The math's terrible. You have a big risk. One, one a stop would be one tick above, entry one tick below, and you have to get at least down to here for one time. So that's not 60%, so it makes more sense to buy below. This is similar to this, in my opinion. It, it's too low in a trading range to be looking to short, especially, well, here, after three bars up, here, you're selling a low one at what's likely going to be a higher low. So I hope this helps. Thank you. Again, sorry for my voice. I have a my microphone is not that great and I'm gonna try and get a new one in a day or so, depending on how this goes. Thank you.